Hey Gators, hey Toros, welcome to Fun Friday Crafting with Mrs. Sua. Little Sua is holding the camera for me. Say hi, Ceylani. Hi. All right, today we will be painting rocks. So for this activity, you will need a rock, mm -hmm. some paint brushes, a cup with water to clean your paint brushes. I have a few different color paints, and then I have an extra paper towel just to dab the water off of my paintbrush. Perfect. So, yeah, thank you. So to get started today, we will begin by painting the base of our rock. And I think I would like to paint an ocean this time. So I'm gonna just do a blue. Like a dark blue? Cause last mm -hmm. time you did a light blue. Yeah, we'll use the darker blue this time. We'll just paint around. And again, we're doing this in the sun. So the sun will help with drying the paint on our rock. Yeah. Because if it doesn't dry, then everything just kind of smears around and then it just, you can't you really see it. what you have. You should hold it. Yeah, that's a good idea to hold around. it. And make sure you wear gloves. Mm. If you need them, because you're going to hold it. Yeah, if you would like to. That's always an option. Okay. So let's give this a little bit of time in the sun while I clean my paintbrush over here. Ooh, Look at the water. Like See, the water changes colors depending on what paint you're taking off of your Beautiful. paintbrush. And we want to clean our paintbrushes really well because some of this paint is acrylic paint. And so it, it doesn't, when it dries on the brush, it's not really washable and it ruins your brushes. What, what type color? of, what types of things do you see in the ocean, Ceylani? I see fish. Fish? What kind of fish? Clownfish. <gasps> Ooh, we can draw a clownfish. And I was thinking of maybe starfish and an octopus. Ooh. So I will start with a clownfish. clownfish. Clownfish are orange, right? And they need black. We could use a oh, marker after. Black. Oh, that's right. We can. Good thinking. That's why I was keeping it in my mind. So let's do a little clownfish here. Ooh. You're doing a great job, Mom. Why, thank you, darling. This will be you a... You could do a black eye, too. A little clownfish right here. And then what else can we do? You said an octopus. An octopus. Let's have a purple octopus. Yeah. My mom used to sing octopus, octopus, swimming all around you. Octopus, octopus. How many legs do octopuses have? Eight. Eight. Octas, eight. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, seven eight. eight. Perfect. Okay, let's paint our octopus. And we can put some markered eyeballs on that later, mm -hmm. too. And then we will make a... Oh, uh, maybe some coral? Isn't coral green? Oh, you want to... They have different color colors. Yeah. You want to make like, it. Yeah, because I want it colorful. Or it might be kelp. I'm not sure what I'm... Kelp is green. Coral is the colorful one, right? Yeah. There we go. Maybe you should do like a little fish on the side. A little fish on the side? Yeah. Maybe a little blue fish? Yeah, that's pretty. Okay, and then let's do... Might be tricky making a starfish, but let's try it out. Yeah. Here is the orange again. I like orange. Let's make a little starfish down here. Let's see closer. Starfish. Whoa, it's wobbly. Okay, she made a perfect starfish. Oh, thank you. Look at this. Or maybe another yellow starfish. Well, actually, now I was thinking of closing it off, and let's just do some little bubbles. Ooh. Some little water bubbles everywhere. 
Because you love polka dots. Because I love polka dots. Yep. That's really pretty, Mommy. Thank you. And with these, you can add glitter. You can add gemstones if you want to. Whatever you'd like. Yeah, if you want to glue them on. And if you, you have want. them. And this is the other one. Mm -hmm. My mother Let me made. just fix this little clownfish really quickly. And then once that dries, we will be able to get a black marker. And start making the faces. Allie, would you mind going inside and getting me a black marker? Sure. There might be one right there in that. Um... <gasps> the octopus looks already dry. Mm -hmm. You could probably add some eyeballs to that one. The sun is so warm out here. Mm -hmm. Feels really good. That's why I'm wearing a pink. And you can see our our paper plate has all kinds of color on it Dye. because we're recycling it. Yeah. Recycle is a good thing to do. Mm -hmm. We use this for our butterfly craft that we did last time. That was a fun craft. Got a sharpie. <gasps> oh, and little Sue grabbed us a sharpie. So I'm gonna give my my octopus two eyeballs. Let me smile. What else is dry? <gasps> this little fishy can have an eyeball. And a mouth. And a mouth. The yeah. rock is a little hard to do. Mm -hmm. And then our clownfish. Still needs a little this more time. Still needs a little bit of time, but. Well, there are our finished products. Here was the one that we previously did. That was our flower rock with a turtle on it. Just sits upside down. And then this one right here is our ocean one. We have our octopus, our clownfish, our starfish, our kelp, and or our coral, and our bluefish. Don't forget to clean your supplies, clean up your paintbrushes, and you can see all the different colors that we used inside of our water. Thank you for joining us. Hope you have fun. Post some pictures. Bye-bye.